Okay, this is the plug. Now, just to let you guys know, this plug uh, is an adapter plug. The manufacturer of the radio doesn't know what kind of car you have, so you have to go buy this. Uh, there's an additional picture of this as well. Okay, this is the mounting brackets. It's universal. Um, all you do is look at your old unit and see basically where it lines up at on the old unit. Uh, if you look up on here, you'll see I already did the other side. So, real simple, just mounts down, two screws. Same with the other side, two screws. And if you come up here, see it mounts right in, it sets in there perfect. So, uh, just a little how to on how to do that. Okay, we got it plugged in, we're working. Uh, let's take it up and see what channel we got here. I like this feature so far, it's pretty cool. Uh, helps if we plug the antenna in. Volumes over here, real simple. Of course, if you want to put a CD or a DVD in, got your SD card, pretty nice little setup. Uh, you can also hook up your auxiliaries using this too. Uh, one thing that I did notice that it you have to buy the camera separate with this unit. Uh, it doesn't come with a camera. That's okay, you can put pretty much any camera on it with any audio and video feed into it. And it also feeds out as well. Okay, now we're going to try to pair the phone to this. So uh, take it back to your settings, uh, basically your home page. Hit Bluetooth and come down here. The phone's already searching. It should find it. Ah, car kit. Hit that. Yeah, there's my phone book. Uh, now it's paired. Now you can play Pandora on it. 